Today I have this beaker which is half filled with powdered sugar. Also I have this bottle which contains concentrated sulfuric acid. Now let's see what happens if I dump some sulfuric acid into this beaker. First let's remove the cap and carefully pour some of it into the beaker. And now we have to give the mixture a good stir. As you can see the mixture has started to turn black. Now carefully watch what happens. The sulfuric acid converts the sugar into carbon which in turn forms this strange carbon structure. This reaction is exothermic and it releases a lot of heat. So it is a good idea to allow the structure to cool down before touching it. And this alien looking structure is what we are left to it at the end of the reaction. It might look sturdy but it is very fragile and easily breaks on application of pressure. This reaction was super fun to perform and also it was quite easy. So I decided to try it once more. This time I used a slightly different sulfuric acid to sugar ratio expecting a different result. But the structure formed was almost identical to the first one but a bit smoother. Now if you are planning to perform this experiment remember that this reaction releases sulfur dioxide gas which can cause temporary breathing difficulties if inhaled and can also cause irritation of the eye and so it is suggested to perform this experiment outdoors.